back to the princess project it's me princess and i'm back with another haul it's been a while i know but this time it's going to be a little bit different because i'm doing my first ever lazada haul and this one is for my lazada babes out there who are missing out because i've always been doing shopping hauls so this one's for you i really want this video to feel like the first few hauls that i've done in this channel back then i always prioritized quality over quantity and so for today's video i'm gonna share with you guys a few pieces but i swear each of these pieces are like classic timeless you know my style but these are the pieces that are more likely to stay on my wardrobe. To be honest, there are some pieces in my past hauls ko that I would get rid of because I don't really use them. Like I want to go back to the mindset that I've had before. The time that I was looking at it, that each piece that I buy serves a purpose on my wardrobe. So yeah, I'm so excited to share with you um, new discoveries from Lazada, something new as well. Um, and yeah, let's start. So as usual, let's start with tops. Um, I got a few. Actually, I got three. Um, each of them looks pretty similar. If you've watched my past Shopee hauls, and you probably already know my style, so you know what to expect. But for my new viewers, hopefully it's meron. Um, I usually lean towards more neutrals, classy, classic and timeless pieces and something that I take pride in when it comes to hauls is I try to make my outfits look expensive without it actually being expensive if you know what I mean. So the first top that I got is this one. If you watched my old money inspired haul, you probably noticed that I have a similar top but that other one has a collar, I guess. I mean, they look pretty similar, but I got this because this style is more laid back. It's more for like every day. Yung top ko na yon, I always, always use it, but not for daily chill na mga lakad. And I think this is the equivalent of that top, but ito mas chill siya tignan. What I love about this top, first of all, again, it's a rib knit top. And it's not hard to get these types of fabrics sa Lazada or sa Shopee. So yeah, I still recommend you guys to go for it. And another thing that I like about this is the neckline. I love this like sweetheart cut. I mean, it's not entirely sweetheart cut, but it has the shape of it. And when it comes to cut, I really go for yung mga sweetheart, v-neck. Not too low, but v-neck is an option. I don't really go for round necks anymore because like na yun yung style ko, medyo like evolve na yun yung style ko throughout the year. So I think this top is gonna be again. I always say this, but I always buy yung mga top na magagamit ko for everyday use, like my go-to. This is what I call my go-to top. Na if ever din nata matako magisip ng outfit, I can just take this top and wear some jeans, and I can already go out. Like like this is a no-brainer type of top, and I always always buy these types of top. Kahit sa ang haul man feeling ko, I always have like one at least one go-to top, and I think for this haul it's this one. So yeah, this is the first top, and I got this for 199 pesos. The second one I got is this. As you can see, super similar nya, and I think I've always liked this when it comes to my haul because I want to have a signature look, like a signature uniform type of style. A uniform style is like something that you always see on me. So I tend to buy clothes that are similar to each other, but Hindi naman super like my difference naman. This one is a sleeveless top, as you can see. I usually have sleeveless tops. I love wearing sleeveless tops, but I don't have something like this. This one just gives old money, very classy type of top. It's unlike my other sleeveless tops nga na medyo revealing, medyo more on the sexy side. This one is definitely classy. And similar to the first one, it has this lining. I really like the black lining on white fabric. I think I prefer this over the black fabric with white lining, I think. 
it's a personal preference and you guys know that I love Chanel and these tops they scream Chanel like they give a little bit of the Chanel vibes with like the lining and everything and also the colors so yeah I really love this top and I got this for 204 pesos so for the third top, this one is a little bit different. I don't have anything like this on my wardrobe yet. And it's this top. Oh my god, when I first saw it, I remember my face back in 2018 when I was first watching Gossip Girl. I'm really obsessed with Blair Waldorf. I mean, I still am obsessed with her. And what I notice about her style is she always wears dresses and blouses with this like tie detail. And so, naalala ko, back in 2018, wala pang Shopee lang, I guess. Um, so, okay talaga ako bumibili. And I searched for tops na merong ganitong detail. And another thing that I did back then is yung... Ano yung dun? Yung twilly na nabibili na big 50 pesos. Yung twilly, yun yung tinatali ko dito para magmukha siyang tie <laughs> so the met because I was obsessed I'm obsessed with Blair Waldorf talaga so when I saw this top I was like yeah that's kind of kind of familiar and I really want to get it and when I got it I had no regrets it's so nice the quality is also super nice I mean the quality of these tops are super nice I did not expect that and they're all from the same shop so save tayo sa um, shipping fee but this one, it's just so preppy. It's very like, it gives off very old money again. Very Blair Waldorf vibes. And pa ulit ulit ko na yung mention, alam niyo na siguro. But yeah, I'm so happy with this top. It has these stripe um, print on it. Usually I don't do prints. Hindi ako masyado ma print, but stripes is like a classic type of print. And also the color, it's very uniform once again. And like what I said, it's on brand, it's my style, and I super love this. And I got this for 217 pesos. Okay, so for the next two items that I got, hindi talaga to yung expect ko na darating. Because <laughs> I thought there were a two piece set, but it turns out that I only got the cardigan. So. I got two cardigans. At first, I was kind of mad that it only came with one piece because I got them for like 300 pesos each. And for me, mahal na yun. After a while, when I tried it on, when I styled it, I really, really like it. I like it to the fact that I got another one. Ito yung una kong binili and I super like it that I got another one. So, this is the first one. I think you already get it. You already get why I got this. My girlies out there probably know that I got this because it looks like a Chanel jacket, even though it's not. Save your money, sis. Yes, I love, love how it looks like. It's very, I don't want to repeat the same adjectives over and over again, but it's very classic, timeless, very elegant. And the material of this is actually pretty good. I mean, I won't repurchase this kung hindi siya ganun kaganda. Like, the quality and the fabric is so nice. I think for 300 pesos, okay na siya. It also has the black lining. I love the color. It's in the color apricot. I think the color is much better in person than what it shows off on camera. And also kasi may lighting ako and stuff. But the color apricot is so nice and imagine pairing this with the same apricot um, top underneath. It looks so nice. It will definitely give off Jenny vibes, like for sure. And I ko na lang. Isip lang naman. If I pair it with like an actual Chanel bag, like I can envision myself wearing this in the future someday when I'm successful with a Chanel bag, like a, even a Chanel mini, a black Chanel mini with gold hardware. It's just nice to imagine it sometimes. I mean, that's a fit, that's a look. So yeah, this is the first cardigan and Cardigan is something that is like a staple to my wardrobe that talaga. Even back then, I was recommending different types of cardigans. Um, ito medyo upgraded version lang siya. And this is the other one. This is the classic white one with black details on it. And I really like 
that the pockets are real. It's a plus. <laughs> it's an actual pocket. Kasi nakakainis yung mga ganito lang. Yung parang kunwari lang siya. It gives off an illusion of a pocket, but it's not really a pocket. This one has two pockets to the front and again, the coil is super nice. So I think it's kind of worth it for 300 pesos. Not kinda, it's actually worth it for 300 pesos. And yeah, this one I can pair with white. I have a lot of white tops, so I can literally pair it with half of my wardrobe. Half of my wardrobe is white, so I can just pair it with this and some black jeans. Really nice fitting jeans that I'm gonna recommend to you guys soon. So stay tuned. And like a bag again. Like I have a lot of Chanel dupes over there, but not exactly like because I don't I don't wanna take that I don't wanna take that experience away from me. Like bumili ng fake na Chanel bag. I wanna work hard and actually be able to afford a Chanel bag. But I do have a lot of bags that I recommended in my past hauls that gives off the same vibes as a Chanel bag. So with that, right now, I can totally pair that with this outfit. And yeah, I really love these cardigans. These are great buys. For the price, I got them for 314 pesos each. And yeah, I think it's worth it. Okay, so moving on to bottoms, I only got one. Actually, dalawa to, but they look super similar. I'm gonna show you guys. I got a skirt, and I've been eyeing on these skirts for a while. And this is what it looks like. It's like a mini skirt. So, at yung una. I can... Tingnan niya to, ah. They look super similar. This is the first one. And this is the second one. Like, can you tell the difference? They look exactly the same to me. I mean, it has a little bit of details na magkaiba. Like, the back of the skirt has this detail. Ayan, paganyan siya. And the fit is actually different. Um, this one, ganito lang siya. And the slit of this one is higher. It has shorts underneath, which is a good thing. So, maybe ito yung mga pang tennis talaga na skirt. I mean, like, I'm really going hard on the preppy tennis girl outfits that I got an actual tennis skirt. I mean, it's cute. The, the fit of this is so nice. I actually prefer this over this one. And I discovered that my cousin is also eyeing on this skirt. So, bibigay ko na to sa kanya. So, we can have like a matchy-matchy moment. Again, I can pair it with so many different tops going for that preppy tennis girl look. This is perfect for that. And actually, it matches this top and all the other tops that I got. They match each other. And that's so nice and such a nice feeling to have when your clothes match each other. Hindi ka mahihirapan, hindi ka stress. I highly, highly recommend you guys talaga to find your personal style. I think I've said this before, but I recommend you guys to find your personal style. It will definitely help you a lot. I tell that to my cousin. I tell that to my friends. And yeah, I highly encourage people also to avoid hopping into trends and over-consuming. Because if you know your style, you know what you want and what you need. So what you want is different from what you need and you'll not be persuaded um, easily by trends going on and you can just stick to whoever you really are. But let's move on to the bags. I only got two and to be honest, to be honest with you guys, I think I showed this on my last video, a room transformation video. Um, all of the bags na nakahang dito sa aking um, door over here and I'm gonna do a bag collection video for the next months or so Papakita ko talaga sa inyo yung mga bags ko but right now I am done like I'm done buying bags from Shop Your Lazada I think I have the right amount and the right style of bags in my wardrobe right now like I don't think I need anything more and I think itong dalawang bag na to, I got them because I just need them because of school, because my face-to-face -face na kami, and I've been looking for a bag that I can use face-to-face -to -face that will fit my laptop. But when it comes to the other types of bag, I am honestly done buying them. I am contented with what I have right now, with the collection that I have right now, and I'm really, really hoping that my next bag 
will be an investment. I want my next bag purchase to be my dream bag. Like, yun talaga yung goal ko. Ayaw ko na talaga gumasa sa mga unnecessary because I really want to get like my actual dream bag. So, the first one that I got, medyo feel siya. <laughs> but I really like it though. I got this for my laptop because recently I've been going to school. Um, sa library namin and dun ako nag online class. So, I really need a bag to carry my laptop. This one, unfortunately, it doesn't fit my MacBook. But I do really like how it looks like. I think it's like a perfect canvas bag if you're looking for that. Um, it's beige and it has silver hardware. Um, it's super spacious inside. It's just unlike me. You guys know me. I'm Super into small bags. Ganun ka daming dinadala ko. But lately, because of face-to-face -face classes, I've been really bringing more stuff with me and I need more space. So this one is a nice, nice bag for that. And again, it's a canvas bag. So you can pair it with any outfits. It will not ruin your look. Um, it has a pocket at the back. And the quality is actually pretty nice. It doesn't look cheap at all. I think this bag is super useful. Um, I got this for 288 pesos. So I'm not really a tote bag type of girl. Na isip ko na the only way I can get a bag asap is by buying a tote bag. So I got this bag. I mean, it's the typical aesthetic tote bag <laughs> that you see. And my laptop definitely fits in here. And I also love that it has a zipper. That's super handy because I don't want to lose my laptop. My laptop is my life right now. I'm gonna fit it here. And it fits right in. As you can see. It fits my laptop. It fits a whole bunch of different things. And it also has this like compartment over here which I think is super useful it also has a zipper and you can put here your perfume like pen makeup lipstick anything it will not get lost in a tote bag a reason why hindi ako nagto tote bag is because nawawala siya mabilis mawala yung mga gamit ko sa loob and I don't wanna dig in on a big bag so hindi talaga ako ma big bag type of person but this is and it actually serves its purpose and yeah all of the details and stuff made me love this bag and I got this for only 198 pesos okay so moving on to the last part of this haul I don't know if this haul is super fast or too long because I'm today but this last part is dedicated to scents and this is something that I've never recommended before I've never done this before but lately I'm hooked sa mga scents like perfumes, um, body mist. I've been really into that because I realized from the past few months how important scents are. Like I think, like I think it really completes your outfit. I mean, you could wear the most basic, plain ass outfit like a white T-shirt, some jeans and sneakers, and smell good. And it will automatically elevate your look, elevate your vibe, elevate your presence. And you look and feel expensive and smell expensive as well pala. So yeah, I think it's time for us to invest and really like know our preference when it comes to scents, perfumes, body mist, and stuff like that. And I think the perfect way to start when you're just getting into scents is body mist. Because first of all, it's the most cheap option and you can really try like trial and error kung ano yung mga scents na gusto mo, ano yung mga scents na ayaw mo, and you'll not waste a ton of money um, compared if you're gonna buy a perfume agad na mamahalin. So, I'm gonna recommend a few scents um, I saw this shop on the Zada, and these are Bath and Body Works. I think they're a classic when it comes to scents. I tried different scents for the past month, and these, they are my favorite. I saw these, parang decades siya, 
ng Bath and Body Works na Body Mist. And I got these for only 59 pesos each. I think it's super worth it because you're gonna be able to smell them without actually, you know, spending a lot of money. And dito ko na discover talaga ko ano yung mga scents na gusto ko. So, iba iba yung levels nila kasi kita mo kalit yung talagang ginagamit ko. And talagang tinag try out ko sila. So, the first scent is this. This is Cozy Sunday Morning. Cozy Sunday Morning for me, it smells fresh. Um, it smells like morning freshness. <laughs> I usually spray this sa kwarto ko and kapag pumapasok ako sa kwarto ko, halimbawa nag-CR ako and pumasapalit ako sa kwarto ko, I can smell it and it smells so good. Like, this is not the typical signature scent that I have right now, but it does smell fresh. It smells good. It smells different. I mean, madami ako ibang inamoy and super, super particular ko when it comes to the scents that I like. And I think I'm leaning towards more sweet scents. But hindi yung super like masakit sa ulo type of sweet. But I love smelling sweet and fresh and expensive. Ganon. Ganon yung vibes ng gusto ko. This one is definitely, it has that sweet scent that is not overpowering. But it also has like a freshness into it. For me, yun yung naaamoy ko. So yeah, this is Cozy Sunday Morning. And this is the first one. The next one is... It's also super popular, I think. I think it's popular on TikTok, and I've been seeing this all over. This is Into the Night. I did not expect na magugustuhan ko to, cause like it's pretty popular. Pero I think it's because of the fact na na amoy ko na to dante. It kind of smells nostalgic to me. Maybe that's the reason why na gustuhan ko to. But this is pretty basic, a basic scent, and I think you can't go wrong with this. Medyo hindi ko kasi na ikita na ginagamit ko as a signature scent, but in times na I just wanna smell good or ako lang magisa, ayan, I spray this. My top one and my favorite. This is Pure Wonder. This is my type of smell. It's very, it's very sweet girl, but not sweet girl in a way like a good girl type of sweet. It's more like a very nice, classy woman. Like a girl who enters like a Dior boutique. Ganon. Ganon sweet girl siya. And I don't know, I just, I lean towards the smell and ever since, ito na yung ginagamit ko. As you can see, it is almost empty. And if there's one scent, that I would repurchase in a full bottle, it would be this Pure Wonder. And I also mix this with my other perfumes, which hopefully in the future, I can also share with you guys. So yeah, that is everything for today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely ako nag enjoy ako because like, I miss ko talaga to and I miss talking to you guys. And I genuinely miss sharing stuff that I've been loving recently. This is just the beginning. There is a lot more coming in this channel. So stay tuned and subscribe. And yeah, if you guys end up buying anything on this haul, you can always tag me on my Instagram at Princess Escala. I love seeing your purchases and communicating with you guys through the DMs. So yeah, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you on my next